getting some ducting up here. Roger that, Tim. I will uh, QSY to the 8.5 repeater. N2 MAK, I'll be clear on uh, Bristol. So that's the uh, Bristol repeater down in uh, like the Naples area or so, down in the Finger Lakes. I'm up in uh, Henderson Harbor, New York, up near Sackett's Harbor. Probably 80, 90 miles as the crow flies. Let's switch, uh, try another repeater here. This was on two meters. This will be on 70 centimeters right now. N2MAK, November 2, Mike, Alpha Kilo. Oh, yes. Sounds like you're right under the tower. <laughs> you gotta love it, you gotta love it. Thanks so much. Oh, this is fun. It, it's great when the bands cooperate, and uh, I always try it when I'm up here, because you never know, and sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't, but usually in the mornings or in the evenings, like now, uh, the, uh, the ducks open up. Awesome. Yeah, the more, uh, the more heat and the more humidity there is, uh, the better, the, the better it works. No, you're, 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 you're real, real strong in here. You actually have, uh, actually have uh, a stronger signal here uh, up on UHF than you do uh, Bristol, of course. Bristol is quite a Right away inland, you know, south of south of the lake. Not only that, um, uh, the higher you go in frequency, um, uh, the uh, the uh, we learn in here. The, uh, the, the, the ducting uh, uh, propagation is. And you'll notice that if you uh, if you have any sort of a television. That's how I first found out was the TV channels coming in. That the uh, uh, UHF channels uh, propagate much, much better. Gotta love the view. <laughs> and the, uh, the VHF uh, channels do. Of course, most of the digital channels are on UHF now anyway. Go ahead. RF around and find out. I'm Mike, N2MAK, 7-3.